I don't go up as boss. I don't go up as boss very frequently, for obvious reasons. What are we talking about? Great. Oh yeah, in that like specifically not great sort of way. It's fantastic. Now I don't want to shock you guys with this revelation, but he has fire resistance. That's crazy. I'm sorry. What? I know. Luckily, I don't have any fire weapons. Oh, you're you're very fortunate. Yeah, I don't need that stupid thing anymore. I need I need intellect. I need to be smarter. What's that you were saying earlier about nerds? I well, see. I'm just wearing like a little badge that increases my intellect instead of like actually putting points into intellect. It's uh, not nerd shit, very specifically. Come back here. Oh, stop. Ah, uh, match to roll that. Go me. That looked like it hurt. hurt. Yeah, a little bit. Not again. Excuse me. Excuse me. I think he just wanted to do that attack. Like that, like, phase transition. Maybe. It exploded. Excuse me. That's very rude. So I was informed that he's vulnerable to slip. He, he, he could be slept. Ow. This might be one of those can be an easy to or different. gets better. No, oh, wait, wait, you're supposed to let it, you're supposed to let it heal. Cauterize the wound. He gets angry. Hmm, that's great. Okay, so that wasn't working. Let's try using these. Oh.
I have no time left. Ow. Pardon me, sir. I was changing my fucking talismans. Ouch. Excuse me, sir. Excuse me, I'd like to talk to your manager. I believe he is the manager. Excuse me, sir. I'm trying to inflict you with Scarlet Rot. Yeah. Ow. Okay, I did it. Is there? No, no, I don't want it. I don't want it. Uh, no, you, no, you he got gave it. it to me. Yeah, he, he wanted to give it to you. He, he succeeded. I think Scarlet Rot carried us there for the last bit, Sivvy, I'll be honest. Probably. I did some damage. I wasn't doing very much damage. I'll be honest. Did you do the Scarlet Rot? You did some Yeah. I, uh, I had to throw like five of them at him to Scarlet Rot him in the second phase. Makes sense. Hmm. Does he have... Uh, there is a grace. It's um, it's further up towards the... the big pot. Yeah. No, I see it now. Gold on white is kind of hard to see. It is. And hard to paint in both ways. And then you're going to want to go up the pot. And go to the left. To the right is a dead end. And then you'll end up in a place. Now, apparently, that boss takes more damage from Slash. The more you know. The Forge of the Giants.
Butterflies. Hey, butterflies. Hey, butterflies. There's a grace. Indeed. You got like a whole thing with Melina and she's all like telling you some stuff. Nope. Sat at the grace. Nothing happened. Hmm. Might have to talk to her. If that's an option. I have long observed the lands between. This world is in dire need of repair and death. Indiscriminate. Are you prepared to commit a cardinal sin? Very well. Let my hand rest upon you for but a moment. I put on like the fire resistant talisman and then I don't think I got hit by a single fire attack for the rest of the fight. Just rolled on? Yeah, I just repeatedly rolled on. Sounds about right. Yeah, we're going towards a boss that'll somewhat help your weapon level issues. I don't think it's going to actually matter. And uh, I just don't think this game is designed for big weapons at this point. Oh, earth tree, you shall burn. They need to like double or triple the big weapon damage, basically, to compensate for the small weapons just being able to apply all the bad status effects that do big chunks. Apply dots and also dual hand things. Burn for the sake yeah. of the new lord. Either that or just speed up your other attacks with your big weapons. Because there is like one attack you can do that comes out really fast, but everything else is like hardly worth using. Thank you for guiding me here. Yeah, this is another this is another Souls game where it seems like the Halberd's given like way higher preferential treatment than everything else. I don't really know why. The one who walks alongside Flame shall one day meet the road of destined death. Goodbye. Like, even Great Spears are kind of shit. It's really weird, actually. Like, using, like, a Stab Halberd, and then you, like, swap over to using, like, a, a Great Spear, and the Great Spear is, like, way slower, and you're like, what? Halberds and Spears and Katanas. Oh, uh, it's a FromSoft game, so the Katanas are always good. Although, to be honest, it's mostly just Rivers of Blood and Moon uh, Moonvale that are good. I think, like, regular katanas are, like, fine, but... This is the sort of game where you just want to use, like, you want to get Alexander's stupid shard, his, like, shard of Alexander, and then, like, use weapon arts. Because, as it turns out, if you slightly build towards it, you can pretty much one-shot anyone in PvP with pretty much every weapon art. Is that you guys down there with your summon signs? Yeah. You drop down off the bridge onto the thing. There should be some yeah. summon signs there. Yeah. Just making sure I don't jump off the edge.
Yeah, the, the big weapons just don't hit hard enough to be worth it. Yeah, that's sort of what I was finding. Because, like, I was, I've been doing, like, a lot of co-op um, off recording. And, like, the thing I've noticed big time is that there's, like, a couple of, like, anything that deals percentage-based damage is, like, really good. Which is mostly weapon arts, but it's also just, like, bleed and yeah. shit like that. Like, the meme is, is that the mace that Cam's using has a thing that can actually apply bleed pretty well, even though it's a big weapon. But this mace has too many things on it. Yeah, it's a bleed mace, and he has like a. And there's it comes a weapon with a heal. It's like okay. Yeah. Hey. <laughs> it took a while to look up. It's like, did you hear something? What was noise? Hey. What was noise? 